I'm struggling. I'm not exaggerating. I'm really, really struggling. I find it hard to, to create. And, and that's not because I don't know what I could create or, or that I don't have any ideas. I have a million ideas. The problem is to pick one and actually go and do it. You see, I have this big empty space that I created. A beautiful, beautiful empty space. And now I got to start building. I got to start making something out of it. I want to have the perfect grill area right here behind me in this corner. Two years ago, I bought this property. It was a house, a couple of barns, and a whole lot of crazy stuff that you don't want to know about. We demolished most of the barns and applied for a permit to start building our dream. First, I did the house for the family, of course. You gotta have the wife and kids happy. Then I started working on the barns. Demolished everything that we didn't need, start building it back up. And half a year ago, we started the actual construction of the barn. Now we built this up carefully. We've got the history here. This is an old pig stable. And I wanted to keep the pig stable vibe. I wanted you to see when you walked into the door that this was an old barn, an old pig stable. Beautiful wooden doors, big high ceilings, perfect for barbecuing. Of course, after the construction was finished, we had a big freaking mess and we needed to clear everything out. So the kids pitched in, the wife pitched in, and we did a lot of work cleaning it up and we ended up with this blank canvas. This might be one of the most beautiful pig stables I've ever seen, but on the inside, it looks kind of nasty. We end up with these old walls and the new parts that we had to put in because all of it was torn down by the farmer. We had to make it a solid construction again. And I wanted to have something that can be here for another hundred years, not just for me, but for the people that come after me, something valuable for the future, something sustainable. It feels like it's not even going to be mine. I'm, I'm making it not just for me, but the people after me as well and I wanna do it right. So we're transforming it from a pig stable to a barbecue place. Well, barbecue place, well, my barbecue cooking area. And your, your guys are set up like the thing that you watch all the time. We gotta make it right. You know, we gotta have crazy good elements. And of course, we're gonna have the barbecue in here. I'm just gonna get the Kamado Joe, Big Joe, right in here. But this thing is red and black. And I got white and gray and we need to change that. We need to make the feel of the Kamada Joe at home. You know, it's got to be happy. It's not happy here. It doesn't fit. The colors are not right. So we got to change up the colors. And of course, I already have a setup. I got my gas grill and I got a beautiful burnout kitchen and it's freaking awesome. We built this barn with a purpose. I built it so there are lots of areas for inspiration and to invite friends and guests so that we can barbecue here and enjoy each other's company, to share our knowledge, to share with you guys and to create content. And I'm not just making one spot. I wanna keep on making areas where we can barbecue and have fun. Of course, one Kamado Joe is nice, but I wanna see how it feels. Why not have two barbecues in here? For my old videos, you can go back. We had an old studio in the last house, it was I had the tiniest garden and the whole thing was filled up with the barbecue area. And I always had two Kamado Joes on my side. Those were good times. And I kind of like missed that vibe of being in good company and, you know, having a little, I had a little fireplace in the back as well. It was awesome. It kept me warm and I was able to put a pan on quickly, just heat up a sauce or reheat something or whatever I needed to do. I gotta get that back. I gotta get that vibe back. You know, I don't want the old brick wall. It's kind of like passe, it's gone. I need something new, but it's gonna be a challenge. This is gonna be a challenge. It has to be better than what we had before, and that's gonna be tough. It's gonna be tough, Martian. You gotta help me. This is my 
old, well, it was basically a, an old restaurant kitchen part and I got it second hand. It was just sitting in the back just to store things in, but now I think we might use it again. Can't you just put it, like put it here inside of it? Or maybe, maybe like a little angle around it, like a half moon? Like a half moon around it, and then you can put one in here and one over there. Now you, now you, now you're freaking me out because that's actually a really good idea. Right? Like a half moon. You can even extend this easily. If you put this here, so then it would have to be like this for the videos. But that's that's not like I would have to be. Like, that's not nice. Your half moon idea is actually really great. So if, if there's like a half moon, it would be sitting back here. And I could be over here. Yeah. And I could be like, ha. You can it. Yeah. And you could be over there. We could have this one on the other end. Or like another big Joe, because I like the big Joes. Ooh, we, we could have the fireplace like right here. Yeah, but then you need something for the other side as well. Like a grizzly bear. Like grizzly. Standing like over the top of the grill. I think you guys kind of grasp what I'm struggling with. It's not that I have a problem. I mean, I can't complain about this. This is freaking awesome. But the struggle is how do I get it perfect? And I hope by sharing this video that, well, maybe you guys can give me some good ideas. You can think with me, thinking about what we're going to do, how we're going to make this even better, how we're going to make this look even more epic than it already is because we're doing something crazy here. Nobody's done this before. Nobody built a barn like this. Nobody's built areas like this where you can barbecue and do this for YouTube and for you guys. Because all I want to do is share it. Just make content and get like the best recipes out there for you guys. So yeah, if you guys got any ideas, man, I'm, I'm all ears. And I want to keep thinking about this, but actually I got some ribs on, so I gotta go. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, then leave us a big thumbs up and a comment down below. See you guys next time. Until then, hey, smart And keep on grilling. Oh yeah, big thank you to our patrons and YouTube members. You guys freaking rock, but you know that already. Cheers. Morrison, I think we really need to go with the half moon idea. I think that's with the, with the two big Joes. And then a half moon, but like a chestnut bar, like, like a half moon island. I think that's a great idea. I think that might work. Or we should have like a, like a big fireplace, like a rectangular one behind it. So all of the whole wall. I really want that fireplace. How do we get the fireplace in? How do we get the fireplace?